worst. All right, so I'm taking you um, secret Cupid shopping. I need mom. Do you have a Valentine? <laughs> Dad, look how ugly it is. Good morning, everybody. Happy Monday morning. I'm driving Ryan to school today. He's not in the car yet. Katie left a little bit early, so here Ryan and I go. It's a chilly one this morning. Well, I guess no chillier than what you guys are experiencing. Actually, it's only 39, <laughs> so that's pretty good. It's much better than it was yesterday, but still, it's chilly. So I'm taking Ryan to school and starting this week off beautifully. I hope you guys are having a wonderful week so far. Uh, he's in there uh, finishing up his oatmeal and brushing his teeth. Actually, in the opposite order. Brushing his teeth and making his oatmeal so he can come out here and eat it on the way to school. That's pretty much how that's going to go. Good morning, Ryan. Mm, good morning. You ready for a squala? No. My oh. face isn't. What? I don't know why. I tried to smile this morning. And like I could hear my face bones cracking. <laughs> oh, that's a little it was weird. Bad. <laughs> that I is mean, bad. I mean, not really, but like because I had some movement in my face. Why? Because you just your face just feels stiff, or what's going on? Um, I've never heard that before. No. Yeah, you can't move your face. Oh, but right. my face hurts. Okay, <laughs> it's killing me. <laughs> uh, what class do you have this morning? My alarm didn't go off this morning, and now there's bags under my eyes. Look at my hair. <laughs> okay, we can take care of your hair. We do need to get a haircut. I'm falling apart over here. You are falling apart. What class do you have first? Um, health. Oh, and it's, maybe. And it's kind of right there. Maybe they'll talk about getting to bed on time, setting your alarm, waking up early, yeah, having okay. a nice schedule, so you don't have bags under your eyes, so you're ready for class. I'm going to bed. Time. Do you think I'm, that'll happen? I'm going to bed at like 8 tonight. That's a good idea. Come home, do your homework. Oh, do you good. have to work tonight? I'm a good schlong. Do I have to work tonight? Oh, jeez. Yes. yes. You do? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Please fasten passenger oh. seat belt. Oh, that's you. Bye, baby. Have a great day. All right. I love you. Mama. Bye, baby. I'll see you when you get home. Okay. All right. Make it a great one. All right. I'll try. Okay. Looky, looky. It looks like Ryan's secret Cupid struck. I don't want to touch it, but I'm going to. What did Ryan get? Oh, his Cupid knows him well. He got some Werther's Original. So Ryan is the first Cupid, first Cupid, secret Cupid that I've seen so far. So we'll have to look for the rest of the day and see if we can find any more secret Cupids. Katie and I are getting ready to go for a run. We are in week two of our sort of like workout challenge um, with each other and with ourselves. So what we've been trying to do is three days of cardio, which usually includes run, and then two days of strength workout. Last week, it was raining on the third day that we were supposed to run, so we did a combination HIT, which is high intensity, high intensity interval training and strength at the same time. Then I took two days off, I think Kate did too. We took off Saturday, Sunday, and now it's Monday and we are going out for a run. It's a little bit chilly, so I do have my well, guy, this goes over my ears. So when I was marathon running and half marathon training and all that stuff, I had to run through the winter regardless, like early in the morning when it was icy, snowy, and very cold. So I have all the, all the running gear for that. So Kate and I are gonna get ready to go here in just a second. And um, looking forward to a run. She wants to do hills, so hills it is. There she is. I don't know where my gloves are. Oh, I think they're right in there. And your hat too. You ready for this run? Yeah. Okay, here we go. It's cold. I know. It's like colder in here. I know. It's weird. So as it turns out, Ryan so far is the only one who's gotten a secret Cupid. Oh, well. Did you get anything, Mikey? Nothing. Oh. Do you guys think you have secret Cupids? Oh. Zilch up. Oh, Katie Elizabeth. Sorry, you, Kate. you know you're loved. Yes, you are. Okay, listen, I think Secret Cupids have all day long to get you something. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go, what? What did I tell you, Jilly? I know. What, honey? Whoever has me isn't a very good Cupid. Oh my goodness. Well, Ryan's the only one I think that's gotten anything this whole time. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go pick him up from, from work and then I think I have to take him Secret Cupid shopping. No, 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 no. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, what happened? 
I just stapled myself. Oh, Katie, you can't do that. Just kidding. I got my robe caught in the doorknob and then it like went like this. <laughs> and then it was like, <laughs> okay, so I've given you instructions on what to do. You know, you can do the first. Mm -mm. By the time I get back, yeah. Dad, can you please, please pick up Ryan? I need mom. But he won't take him secret Cupid shopping. And what if Ryan has me? Hi, buddy. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, thank you. Oh, oh cold. are you cold? Yes. Halfway through the pick, I'm chilling, vibing, and it's just start training. Yeah. And it's Monday. Yes. They can't is. really get much better, can it? I know. It's 50 degrees in rain. Well, Terrible. All right, ever. so I'm taking you um, Secret Cupid shopping. Yay. Okay. Yay. All right, don't tell me who you have, but you have a choice. You can go to CVS, Target, Safeway. Huh. Uh, Dick Sporting Goods and buy stuff for yourself. Dick <laughs> Where would you like to go, you think? I think I want to go like the Dick Sporting Goods golf section. I okay. think there's some really solid, um, you know, nice little, little, nice little Valentine things. And, you know, yeah, for exactly. you have. Little knickknacks for Valentine's Day that I can get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> Maybe so. someone could give back to you. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. How was work? It was very good. Well, until it started. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, do you First, have to stop when it rains? No. We tell everybody what you do. Right. So if you've ever been to a driving range before, I drive the picker, which is a car and it has this contraption on the front of it that picks up all the balls. So I drive that at our local range and it's a really annoying because it's an outside job during the winter, which uh, I really have to bundle up for and I like have to like get gloves and everything. Also when it rains, it can get like muddy on the range. And it's Did really you get annoying. stuck? No. He has gotten stuck before. I've though. gotten stuck in the mud like twice. <laughs> It's horrible. It's a horrible situation because you got these golfers just bombing, just bombing balls down the range, and you're trying to like get the car. You're unstuck. like ducking, exactly, <laughs> ducking balls, and it's just yeah, it's chaotic. So not a good uh, position. Builds character, Ryan. Builds character. All right, well, we'll, we'll go shopping oh. now, nice and warm. Maybe I'll get you hot chocolate or something. Oh, okay. Whoa, 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 I whoa. know. Uh, do you like the hair? <laughs> I'm gonna give Ryan some money, send him off. I'm gonna go to Starbucks and get us some hot chocolate okay. while he's shopping. Mm -hmm. I do need to get some milk though, so I'm gonna do some of that. Right. Are you gonna film your um, shopping? Oh, I don't know, maybe you shouldn't. <gasps> no, you can't film oh, your no, shopping. I can. No, because yeah, what if I'm editing and then, or dad's editing and we see what you bought and then we can put two and two together and know exactly what you have. So you're gonna have to be quiet about it. Okay, so let's come over, we'll pull over and I'll go ahead and give you, uh, give you your 20 bucks. Oh, Sound good? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> All right, how'd your shopping go? Very well. What do you got back there? <laughs> don't look. No, no, don't look. I'm shocked. I Jenny, got you. A hot chocolate. So You're welcome. Enjoy. Uh, I feel like it was weird. Because? Everyone was looking at me and shopping. It, like, I, it was funny because all the dudes were shopping in the Valentine's Day section getting stuff for their, their women. Their dudettes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you think, gas. Is it gas? Um, do you have a Valentine? No. For the year, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. Anyway. It's okay. In due time, honey. Yes. In due time. You're talking very loud. I'm sorry. <laughs> Hi, Molly Hey. This looks really jank. It looks cool. Do you, <laughs> want, do you want to look at it? What is, jank? What, is, what does that mean? Look at this. And what then is you'll know. It does, it's a synonym for cool. <laughs> Shoot him for what? For crunk. Crunk. What is crunk? <laughs> it's like <bunk>. Jane. <laughs> <laughs> We're going Jane. around and around. Dad, look how ugly it is. It's busted. It looked even the worse. Nail the nails. <laughs> the pins. The nails. I mean, the shape, whatever they are, they are. They won't go all the way in. And you the ones to... that look like they're all the way in aren't all the way is this in. An antique? You have to push it against the know. thing. I then... watch. No, okay. Was... Yeah, watch. I've been putting my whole entire body weight. Oh wait, that was. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's exactly no, that. it was broken. Oh. Hold on. Watch. Yeah. Bent. Mm. So now it's crunk. Crunk? Jank. Jank. Busted. Bust. All right, maybe mom can offer some help. That's why I told her not to leave. All right, you got a lot there. Got a lot of them in there. Because someone's gonna sit on it. And then fall through? Yes. <laughs> oh, I forgot someone to like sit on that. 
Oh well, but that like that's gonna be your main source of stability. Uh oh. Here's the problem. The, the staples aren't gonna go in here. You sure? Would you like to try? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. Find a spot. Might be hard. There's a ton of staples. Here you go. Mm -hmm. Here, I'll put one out for you. Mm -hmm. so. Watching you get it in. Yeah, I'm gonna be so mad. Dad, do you have tweezers? Tweezers? Or grabbers? Grabbers? Like the things that you have in your toolbox. Uh, they grab things. You mean pliers? Yes. <laughs> Why did you keep going if you knew it wasn't working? Because I wasn't going to sit here and do nothing. And I wanted to take the pins out. <laughs> Things have gone terribly wrong, Ma. <laughs> yeah, something like that. <laughs> Ready? Push hard and... Boom. That literally it looks like an M. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What's well, kind of hard? You know what we'll do? Hmm. Take them out. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Like what happened? Did you show the kid? Did you see? Can they see what's going on with the nails in here? Look at. So she tried to use a st staple gun, and look, they're all. That is that is not that is not gonna work. Did you try some of these? I tried one. And how'd it go when you tried it? Not too well. Oh. Wood's pretty hard. So what's that? So what's that mean for like the other side? When we go to put the little. That means I'm good. But those tacks, you're going to hammer those in, are you not? The tacks I am. Uh-huh. But, yeah. Okay. Oh, well, Alice thinks it's nice. Hi, Alice. You going to get all snuggly in there? It's fine, because we're taking that piece of fabric off. Oh, my gosh. We might have to, you know what, we might have to glue it. Oh. Actually, I think we'll fabric glue it. Oh. Yeah. <clears throat> I think that's the way to do it. Or hot glue it onto the bottom. You, you're so cute. All right, so next is taking all these staples out. Oh. All right. Well, it's it, it's underneath. <laughs> it looks terrible. Yes. Yeah. It, it, why does the bottom have to look nice? Because I mean, it can't look unprofessional. You know, it's yeah. We gotta do that. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Michael John. The second Cupid, secret Cupid was found. Right. I'm for tiny conversation hearts. Ooh. Let's see what they say. Hmm. I used to like those when I was a kid. Be mine. Mm -hmm. Give me a kiss. Mm -hmm. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Get lost. You smell. <laughs> <laughs> You're a jerk. Glasses. Rockstar. Rockstar. Boom. Okay. This one that is. That one's correct. This one says. Kiss me. Kiss me. Oh. Thank you, sweetie. That's nice. What, who, Why are you thanking me? I don't know. This is very exciting. We have two more to get or to be delivered. All right, Kate, we need to have a little conversation about your stool. Mom. <laughs> your bench. Let me tell you. Yeah. Oh, hey. Yes, please. I told you uh -huh. that I needed help because I didn't know how to do it. And I was gonna mess up, and you said, "Oh no, you can do it. All you have to do is fold over the edges." Cause I believed in you, Katie. <laughs> okay, all right, <laughs> joking. No, I really did. It looks like Edward and Alice are pooped. They've done way too much work today. All right, so Kate, this is they the deal. They don't do anything. I they don't know. have to do anything. Ever. I know. They're so they just lucky. They exist, and we feed them, and and we play with them. I know. Them. I know. They have the best little lives. And you know what right. we get in return? Love. Scratches. We get lots and lots of Scratch love. Marks. That's what we get in return. All right, Katie is having some coffee ice cream. And were you going to Not just any cream? old coffee ice cream. Briar's coffee ice cream. Briar's coffee ice cream, which is the best coffee ice cream. Second to... The stuff Killings. you had at Disney. Oh! Third to Killens <laughs> and the stuff I had at Disney. That so was so good. good. And now I'm never going to forget it. And I'm... Gonna want to go to the boardwalk and get coffee every ice cream. time. Yeah, we can do that. Okay, so we this can? is the deal. Yeah, we okay. have to we have to switch gears, you guys, on how we're going to be handling and taking care of the bench. I think what we might need to do the wood was too hard to do staple gun, so we might have to do a little bit of glue, and then we might have to do a glue. little bit of nail. Uh, stay tuned. So, guys, this 
project is dragging on and on, so you'll probably see it in the next vlog as well. We're not going to complete it tonight like we thought we were going to, but, um, oh, thank you. All right, are there any other Cupid deliveries, Mike, that I need to film? Uh, You're so well, sweet, Katie. There's Katie, one for you, Joe, but you haven't found it yet. There's one for me? Yes. And there's I one for it. Mom? What? Cupid came, yeah, enjoy. Cupid came? Cupid came. Alrighty then. Let me go see if I can find it. Katie, what made you happy today, baby girl? My run with you was good. Yeah. My day at nice school one. was good. Good. Um, I got a 13 out of 15 on this reading quiz that a lot of people failed. So oh. that was good. Oh, nice. Uh, Congratulations. Thank you. I got a math homework done, got a physics homework done. Hang out with Molly, hang out with Kaden. Pretty much about a pretty Gosh, good day. You're rocking it today. I already mentioned the run, right? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. All right. What made you happy, Mom? Thank you for asking. What made me happy today was definitely my run, and then I did stretch, stretch out with my friend Susie Canada. My friend Susie, who lives in Canada. Her name's not actually Susie. Her name's not really Susie Canada. No. I call her Susie Canada because. About 10 years ago, actually, she and her husband and their kids moved here for a year, I guess. I think it was two years. Two years, maybe, yeah, for work, and then moved back to Canada. But while she was here, she made quite an impact. I, we got along very well. She made very many friends in the neighborhood. She's a fitness buff. She was a total fan of Katie doing gymnastics and all that stuff because her girls do gymnastics. And anyway, so she does um, online or virtual fitness classes now. All right, let me go find out what made Ryan, oh wait, how about maybe first I'll find out what made Mike happy today. What made you happy today? Well, thank you for asking. You're welcome. What made me happy today was... Mm. Nothing. <gasps> you got a, um, you got a Cupid. I did. I got a Valentine's Day Cupid with those nice things. So I think it's, I think my Cupid might be you're taking a guess? I'm not sure. I okay. think it is too. You do? Okay. Katie thinks dad's Cupid is Ryan. I don't know who my Cupid is because I haven't gotten mine yet. <laughs> okay. Oh, maybe it's hiding somewhere and oh, you just don't know it. It must be Ryan. Ryan, are you downstairs? Let's go find out where the missing Cupid is. Ryan, are you down here? Oh. Okay, well, there you have it. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Comment down below what made you guys happy today. And we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.